In the hydraulic calculation window, we showed you how to split the floor automatically. Now it's time to show how it can be split manually. Draw manually a single or multiple lines to serve as a referential dividing elements. You can use the detail line for this. Click on the split floor icon. Select the floor and click finish. Select dividing lines and click finish. The floor has been divided. Lines can be deleted afterwards. This tool can be used for example to switch functionality of the part of the floor so that it's heated by feed pipes, but we will present this at the later stage of the project. A floor newly created via manual split is not automatically assigned to the manifold as it is the case with automatic split. It should therefore be assigned to the manifold as we did with all the floors at the beginning. Now the manifold has increased by one additional output and the newly created floor has its connector. It is good to calculate the floors thanks to which the connector will receive the appropriate spacing dedicated to this floor. This can be done with the pipe spacing return temperature function next to hydraulic calculations.